Hey everybody, it's Dr. Barrett. How do you get rid of cankles? We're gonna show you today, all right? Our patient's 27 years old. We're gonna do liposuction of the calves, define them, and the ankle area, and a very careful procedure to highlight the calf ankle junction, okay? There is a technique for this, and I'm gonna show you how it's done, so come on, let's do it. Okay guys, so we're injecting tumescent solution and this is really important because one, we want to numb the area, it has lidocaine solution in there and it also has epinephrine. And epinephrine is what prevents bleeding inside the, uh, the fat area once we do liposuction. You get a lot of bleeding if you don't have that. Tumescent solution is taking effect. How we know is if the calf starts to get pale here, that shows that the, um, the area is no longer getting as much blood flow, which we want, because we don't want bleeding. So we're breaking up the fat in the calf, you guys. This is going to liquefy the fat so it removes very carefully. We're gonna start our liposuction now, guys. This should look pretty satisfying, all right? We're gonna get all this fat out. Now it's all liquefied in there. And you can actually see the fat starting to come out. This kind of nice white substance that shows that our tumescent really worked. We're gonna stop halfway. I just wanna show you the difference. Check it out. This side is done. Look at that definition. This side is not done, okay? After lipo, for lipo. What a difference. Woo! Bye bye, Kinkle. Well, that's it for a calf liposuction procedure. We did a high definition calf liposuction as well as safe liposuction technique. What that means is we gave her calves definition in addition to doing a safer technique so that she doesn't get a whole lot of swelling and she has a lower risk of compartment syndrome. So what do we take out? This amount of fat is a record for us, you guys. This is all from her calves. Um, this is a lot of fat and she's not a very fat patient, okay? She's actually very skinny. That being said, it's important to know that calf liposuction has a lot of swelling. You can have swelling up to six months of your calves if you're not careful, all right? So our patient will probably expect to have about six weeks of swelling. A little bit of numbness is completely normal. A little bit of drainage from the fluid sites for about first 24 hours. But other than that, it's not very painful. It's just a lot of swelling you have to deal with. You have to have your legs elevated for the first few nights. But other than that, she's gonna have a great result. It's gonna match her body. If you have questions about calf liposuction procedure, check out my website, uh, Dr. DanielBarrett.com. Feel free to leave any comments, questions, feedback right here on my YouTube page. And if you like more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Thank you guys.